People would like, would like a natural, would like to cut that off, too. Looking at a 1924 Hartman Grand, uh, about a five foot two, and it's in uh, walnut. Uh, it's real, uh, real nice color on it. It's uh, more of a custom color. It's got a, a little bit of a reddish uh, tint to it, but uh, while still being brown. And uh, really, the piano's assembled now. Uh, I'm sure you've seen some of the other videos with it, uh, kind of going through the. Uh, work on the uh, reconditioning of the piano. Now it's assembled and uh, just lacking a tuning and once being tuned I uh, get another clip out of it being played. It's got a nice original ivory keyboard here. Um, keys are in real good condition. Um, also the uh, plate has been regilded. Uh, which uh, truly adds a real nice uh, touch. Let me see here so if I can get the light around here for you to see it. and lift this up. But the uh, plate's been regilded. Uh, and the uh, soundboard's in good shape. Uh, that is not a crack there. It's actually a soundboard joint that is uh, just dark, just a darker color, but um, in any case, uh piano's in real good shape, and uh, it um, has a real neat look on the cabinet. Let me see if I can show this again. Here on the music rack, you see the vertical, vertical grain here on the music rack here, and then uh, even on the fall board, and get the light around to it here. But you can see the vertical grain pattern there on the fall board. And uh, on the cat on the side of the case you have it as well, but it's also that waterfall. That's called a waterfall pattern. You can see there. Um, legs has have the brass ferrules on the bottom. And uh also has a bench. Um, and uh, if you have any questions or anything, feel free to, to contact me. Um, easiest way is at uh, Twitter, if you have a Twitter account, just twitter.com slash, uh, I'm sorry, twitter, twitter.com at Beaver's Piano. Um, if you want to just write uh, over at the forum, I have a forum, pianos.proboards.com. Um, also, Facebook, if you have a Facebook account, facebook.com slash piano rebuilder. And um, be glad to hear from you if you have any questions or anything you want to know about moving, delivery, that sort of thing. Or if you have your own piano and you're wanting to make it uh, look like this one, that's not a problem either. So um, look, uh, keep an eye out for this same piano after it's tuned. You'll uh, see, uh, see it being played and get a good idea of what it sounds like. Thanks so much.